Hello everyone. In this video, we will see how to interface an LCD with Arduino board using Tinkercad website. I have taken an Arduino board, a breadboard and an LCD here. Now, in order to start the connections, first let us see the pin description of this LCD. These are the pins of LCD from 1 to 16. This is a 16 by 2 LCD that is it will have 16 columns and 2 rows. The first pin is ground pin, second one is power supply, third pin is used to adjust the screen contrast. Fourth one is used to select the register. Fifth one is for read write. Sixth one is enable. Seventh pin to fourteenth pin. These are the data pins. Then fifteen and sixteen are used to connect to LED. So this is the pin description. Register select. It is used to select either the data register or instruction register data register is used for reading and writing instruction register is used for read similarly read and write pin is used for giving read and write signal so now let us go back to our circuit first we will connect to positive and negative to the breadboard this is 5 volts of Arduino pin I'll connect to the breadboard then I'll connect 0 volts or ground to breadboard Change the color to black so that easy to, it is easy to recognize. Then this is ground pin you can see here. So we connect to ground. Then second pin is power. So we connect to power. I'll change it to red. Then this last pin is a cathode pin of LED here we connect it to ground again then here read or write pin this has to be low so therefore I connect it to ground and make it black then for adjusting the contrast, we use a potentiometer. Take a potentiometer and connect on the breadboard. The first terminal of the potentiometer, we connect to positive. And the third terminal, we connect to negative. And the middle pin is used, that is the wiper of the potentiometer is connected to the contrast pin of LCD. Let us make it yellow. Yeah. Now, this register select and enable pins, these I will connect to 12 and 11th pins of Arduino. This is register select and this is enable. Next, here we are going to use only 4 pins, data pins. So let us start connecting from D4. We use from D4 to 
d7 so d4 all connected to number 5 all the data pins let us say we will make it into blue color wires then d5 will connect to pin number 4 then d6 I'll connect to 3 and d7 I'll connect to 2 let us quickly change the colors of all these wires now here we connect a resistor so one is connected to positive and this other end will connect to the LCD and out pin of LED so these are the connections next we have to write a program for this this is the code I have already written for using an LCD we have to include the header file of LCD which is liquid crystal dot H then we have to initialize the library with the pin numbers liquid crystal lcd within the brackets we give the pins these pin numbers are nothing but the pin numbers of Arduino board which we have connected to lcd we have connected pin number 12 11 5 4 2 and 3 so therefore these pin numbers we will give in this function then in setup function you have to declare the size of the lcd you have to give the number of columns and number of rows here it is a 16 by 2 lcd so therefore we write lcd dot begin 16 comma 2 then whatever you want to print on lcd it can be done using the function lcd dot print within the quotes i have given here hello world then in loop function we have used the function set cursor to 0 comma 1 that is it will set the cursor at the position 0 comma 1 line 1 indicates that it is second row 1 indicates second row and 0 indicates the first column so now we will close this code let us start simulating ok so you are able to see that the power of the LCD is on but in order to see the message you have to adjust the contrast which can be done using this potentiometer change the position of the wiper so now the contrast is adjusted and you can see the message displayed on the LCD so this is how you can interface an LCD with the Arduino board on Tinkercad website.